What's up, everybody? It's time to give out the SYAD of the week. Now, the SYAD, the segment we do each week where we tell at least one person to... Man, sit your ass down. <laughs> and let's get right into it. You know what I never see? I never see men trying to humble other men because of their dating standards. I only see women doing that. Don't worry, I got this, fellas. Just hold your horses. I got this, fellas. She never see men trying to humble other men based on their dating habits or for their dating habits. She only see women doing that. First off, I would like to say I did hit you up in your DM, ma'am. So if you see this by any means, please hit me back. I would love to have you on the podcast. So I'm not trying to have a conversation about you. I'm just trying to have a conversation about this topic. And secondly, I want to say you may not see this because maybe your algorithm is not saying this or not allow you to see this because it definitely happens. I'm someone in particular who has called out men regarding our dating habits and dating choices. And because I call it out, because I post things like that, I see that in my algorithm. If that is the case, if there's something that's not as frequent as you would like, it's probably because men recognize that life humbles men. So a lot of men are not fortunate enough to have a man or old school or dad or mentor, a male figure, hippie to gain prior to you running into life. Not only life, that girl in the third grade that will tell you, ooh, your breath stinks. That girl in the fifth grade that will tell you, ooh, you can't dress. That girl in 10th grade that will tell you, ooh, you ugly. All along the way, women have told men exactly who they are. But let's flip the script. All along the way, men are telling women who they are. But the issue is, women don't believe us. They tell us that we hating. They tell us that we got small D energy. They tell us that you shouldn't talk about a woman. You sassy. Anytime a man say something towards a woman in a critical fashion, she rejects everything he says and chooses to go to someone who affirms what she is instead of confirms what that man may have told her. What you may be referring to, ma'am, is the remnant of women that have come out to speak truth as they see it regarding the way that women treat men and the way that women operate in dating. This was a recent post by you, so I'm assuming you're doing this based on the recent list that went viral. You may be saying that women are wrong for correcting other women dating choices, but that's the problem in a nutshell and that raises a beautiful question. Who can be critical of women? Because when men do it, we got small D energy. But when women do it, we got women like you saying she's wrong for doing it. Who can correct a woman? Are women to walk around the world without any sense of accountability? Are women right no matter what choices they make? I would love to hear that answer. But the answer to your question is, men don't have to humble men because life does. Man, set your ass down. 